Oh, yeah. Come on. Biggest fan. This can guy. I, can I get a sign your signature on my Apple Watch? How would you do that, bro? I bought this Apple Watch from my e-commerce store. Really? I've watched all your videos. Dude, I appreciate you. If you have the tiniest amount of desire in, in doing e-commerce, Shopify, this guy is the king. Who man always has the cool whip. I'm, not, I'm jealous, I'm not gonna lie. And this color, insane. Look at it. Yeah, these are definitely up next on the list. Yeah. See, one of these is up next. I'm telling you guys this right here, super doable, especially living in LA. So you see cars like this and like Rolls Royce, it's all the best cars you see in here. Being in LA, honestly, like I always get to see all kinds of different cars like Lambos, Rolls Royce, pretty much any of the cars or uh, the most exotic car you guys can even think of. I always see them here all the time. And so you start realizing that like all these cars and like all these different things are very attainable honestly like it's not that hard to get a lamborghini like this huracan probably go for about a quarter million dollars just like who man said i was actually looking into getting one i'm still planning on it for like 100k down and like three grand a month you know so that's obviously like for some of you guys that are just getting started that may seem like unattainable but in reality like 100k down after a few months of having your business rolling like that's not that unrealistic and 3k a month i mean after again you have your business going like again that's super realistic so i uh, just thought i'd share that with you guys i've lived in la for about seven months now but i actually don't go out too much here so i haven't really got to see too much of the area but we're at down in downtown right now i wanted to just make this quick video on another video that i was actually watching earlier it was a video on one of the most successful people of our time jeff bezos and he was covering a few different topics i was watching this video and i had a few different pickups from this video because it was such a powerful video and i wish i could show it to you guys right here but if you look up jeff bezos on youtube honestly any interview that you can find from him is obviously like super powerful but in this particular one he was talking about his mindset when it comes to coming into any opportunities he brought up how a few years back around 1994 it was actually before i was born 1994 he was working in wall street for a financial firm and of course you know he was making like six or seven figures at the time and he wanted to take this chance to you know you guys some of you guys may already have heard the story but he wanted to take this chance to go and start this book company right and of course he was talking about how everybody was looking at him like he was completely insane because he wanted to go try out this thing called the internet for him he had somewhat of an idea that selling books online was some somewhat of an opportunity that could work but his mindset coming in is like it's gonna take time but i know that with time this is something that can turn out to be something really big preparing himself and getting into that mindset coming into the opportunity knowing that it's going to take time played a huge role into his success because it allowed him to stick through all the tough times that obviously starting amazon went for him starting off amazon as a book company into turning it into what it is now it wasn't like something that just happened overnight like that's just not how it played out there was ups and downs but because he already mentally prepared himself and he knew that this journey would take time it was a lot easier to go through the tough times and actually play the long-term game because he knew that in the end there was going to be a much bigger and a much better outcome for what the company started as right obviously it started as just a small book company and as you guys know now amazon's one of the biggest companies in the world that was one of my biggest takeaways because i see one of the mistakes that a lot of us make in our time right now is we come into all opportunities thinking that we're going to get results right away and so what that does is it makes us so that when we do come into that opportunity and by the next 24 hours we're not seeing any results then we immediately want to give up because because obviously we didn't prepare ourselves to put ourselves in that state where we know that whatever we're gonna do or whatever we're gonna try out it's gonna take a lot more than just 24 hours or a week or a month or a year it's gonna take time to get good at whatever it is that you're trying out and really see results with it I wanted to make this video because I know a lot of you guys that are out there like you're thinking about trying out a new opportunity and you're on the fence about it because either you heard that it takes a really long time to get results with it or you know you just aren't confident that even trying out that opportunity is going to work out within the time frame that you want it to work out in. and honestly what you guys should do based on what i learned from jeff bezos is just prepare yourself with that mindset of what i'm going to do is going to take time no matter what like i'm going to have ups and downs for me that's something that i'm going to try to do a lot more often with a lot of new things that i do because sometimes even me up to date whether it be like learning a new skill set or trying out a new business or pretty much anything that i do like i catch myself sometimes now that i think back trying to come with the mindset where I'm trying to see how fast I can get results with it rather than thinking well I know this is gonna take some time but the time is gonna be ultimately worth it right the point of this video was to get that across to you guys to share with you guys one of the main takeaways that I got from this Jeff Bezos interview obviously 
anything that we can learn from the greats you guys know that i'm a huge fan from learning from the best people of our times and so i figured why not take a second to put together this quick video just sharing that with you guys because i know that for a lot of you guys and even for me again like it's something that i catch myself doing and i've definitely done before so hopefully this will help you guys out whenever it comes when the time comes for you to make decisions on you know what kind of opportunities you should take advantage of and what kind of mindset you should have coming into them so we're getting ready to head down to either santa monica but if you guys are ever in la make sure you come check out the downtown area it is like the super touristy area besides that hope you guys picked up or thing or two from this video if you did i appreciate it if you dropped a like of course and let me know comment down below and let me know if you think back to any times where you have caught yourself doing the same right coming into an opportunity maybe you guys are thinking about getting started with e-commerce and drop shipping right but you're thinking about how fast you can get results i know it's happened to me before with other opportunities so I'm curious to see who else it's happened to because i know i can't be the only one and of course if you haven't already make sure you smash that subscribe button join the v fam and i'll see you guys in the next video peace